More news is coming in. Islamist preacher Zakir Naik has slammed the Waqf bill. Reject Waqf reform bill. Modi Mantri Vijuju has hit back at Zakir Naik. Don't mislead Indian Muslims is what the government has said, what the minister has said. The government versus Zakir Naik war over Waqf law change. The minority affairs minister has taken serious objection to what has been said. I would go straight across to Munish Pandey getting in more details. Munish, this is direct interference in the affairs of the country and also misleading is what the government believes and that's why this kind of a response from the Minority Affairs Minister to Zakir Naik's statement. Absolutely, Sneha. And uh, Dr. Zakir Naik, who is a wanted accused as far as uh, India is concerned, he is hiding in Malaysia. There have been requests of extradition from the Indian government, but uh, Dr. Zakir Naik has not returned to India. Now, as far as Zakir Naik is concerned, he has been known for giving such provocative speeches, provocative, uh, you know, statements. And once again, he has given a statement in which it seems that he is trying to mislead the Muslims of uh, India. And that is why the government has now uh, reacted to this thing that uh, he is someone who is misleading India. is a democratic country and Indian Muslims have their own opinion about the bill. So he is no one who should be giving uh, any lecture or statement as far as India's internal affair is concerned. Now, Dr. Zakir Naik is someone who is wanted accused by the national investigative agencies. Remember, he is facing terrorism charges. He is facing charges on creating enmity between uh, Hindu and Muslims. And once he is hiding in Malaysia, he is time and again giving such statements and speeches. Yeah. Right, I'm going to thank you. Munish Pandey getting us up to speed with those details as far as the government's response to Zakir Naik there is concerned.